Good morning. Good morning. How you doing? I'm wonderful. How are you doing? I'm doing excellent. Now, would you do us the honor of introducing yourself and tell us what you do? Well, my name is Clinton Harris. I am the founder and owner of Clinton Harris Coaching. I'm a number one best-selling author. I uh, have a couple of other company endeavors I'm involved in, but we'll just stop there. That is fantastic. Well, I want to encourage you to tell us more. This is a time for you to be seen and celebrated. So what made you get into all of this work that you're doing? Tell us maybe a little of your point of entry. <laughs> point of entry was a little bit odd. I was working with Brendan Bouchard and um, ended up just deciding I wanted more. And more equated to me quitting. Mm -hmm. And the next day I went home and started writing a book. The book turned out to be a novel. Uh, 28 days later, it was at the editor. 40,000 words, 18 chapters, and here we are now. And I started my life coaching company and we went from there. Fantastic. Fantastic. I knew there was a powerful story there needed to be seen and celebrated. Now, you have been selected as an award winner here at this conference. How do you feel? Uh, quite frankly, I was surprised. I asked them to check my social, make sure it's right. But, <laughs> uh, but other than that, you know, I, I've done a lot. I've been involved in, you know, this type of atmosphere for quite a, some time. A uh, couple of other awards, you know, have been bequeathed to me, let's call it that. But this one actually truly, you know, hit home. It was just something I was surprised with, you know, being top 100 in the world stands out. It just, you know, I was flabbergasted. So all I can say is I, I'm very thankful and grateful. And that's all. That's amazing. Now, what do you think about the work that you've been doing really stood out to the selection committee when they were looking at you and your profiles and everything that you've done in the field? I'm assuming my selflessness. You know, I take on clients. Some of them are absolutely free. If they need the, m the people that need the most help are the ones I don't allow to pay. You know, those are the people I want to come on board and I want them to experience a better life. Uh, coming from where I come from, you know, I, w I know what that's like to be down and out and, you know, want to turn your life around. So I want to be that, you know, that beacon of light for them to be able to help them get to that point. And that human connection that you're able to make by having that passion, that drive, I'm sure it's transformative for those who participate or experience it. Absolutely. Uh, my clients, uh, or some of them become friends, lifelong friends. I have people all over the world, in England, you know, Asia, whatnot, that still contact me just to say how you're doing, you know, or thank you, you know. And these are clients from years ago that are still, you know, showing that gratitude for, you know, getting to that next level. They say it's through me. It was really through them. I just pointed them in the right direction. It's beautiful work that you're doing. Now, tell us a little bit, what has your experience with the Global Forum for Education and Learning been like so far? It has been an amazing experience. There's so many network opportunities. Uh, people from all over the globe come together, uh, basically to just, you know, not just network, but to, you know, talk about, you know, accolades, talk about how to better education for the world, not just one country, but the world, and that's what's really important, especially in this time with COVID going on and people not being able to go ahead and reach those educational institutions like they used to or, you know, through different means. So it's, this has been an experience for me that I'll always cherish. Now, if we want to learn more about what you're doing, how do we stay connected? Is there a website? What do you recommend? Well, I have more than one website. Uh, we're more than one company, but we'll go ahead and use ClintonHarris.com. Uh, go there. You can find out uh, what I truly do and find links to my books and other endeavors I'm involved in, if you're curious. Oh, we are looking forward to exploring. It has been a pleasure, delight speaking with you this morning. Congratulations again, and thank you for everything that you're doing for the field of education. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. And we'll see you at the comedic set later tonight. <laughs> we heard you had some comedy planned for everybody. Headlining, how about that? <laughs> Is it true that you have a partner that's going to be headlining with you? Absolutely. Uh, she will be there. Watch that video. My panel was amazing. Uh, so watch that. You'll know who exactly we are, and I want you to explore who they are because they're incredible individuals. Not just saying it. We met literally a day ago. Lifelong friends already. So explore. So we will see you next year at the Global Forum for Education and Learning with this friend again. Absolutely, with Taruna. Um, she and I did give her name. She, you guys will have to explore who this woman is. She's incredible. She's an inspiration. Look her up. And we are just delighted to be able to celebrate and be honored with the gift of your presence and the presence of all of these wonderful educators. So thank you again for taking time to chat with us today. Thank you so much. Happy.